everybody. It's me, C N B, and today I am back with another ASMR video. Today we are doing a long overdue video, and hopefully a video that is going to do a uh, big service to all of you MLB the Show players out there. I feel like every time I'm streaming and I'll be the show, especially on TikTok, I get a good bit of people say uh, they have no idea how to play Conquest. They they don't know, um, you know, how to move the, you know, take over the board and everything. So I thought it would be fun to do a Conquest over-explained video, kind of similar to the Blackjack over-explained video that I did ago and I there's something about over explaining things that um, just really uh, resides with people and is kind of relaxing right even if you you know everything there is about MLB the show hearing something broken down at the absolute novice level rookie level can be very very relaxing so that being said if you're new that subscribe button. If you're a returning subscriber, hit that like button before you sit back, relax, and enjoy. All right, so the first thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go over to single player modes and then scroll on over to conquest. Now, there are tons and tons and tons of conquests to do. They've had a conquest for every team affinity. Uh, well, actually, Season 1 Team Affinity, they did. Okay, so there's a conquest for each uh, West, Central, and East for Season 2 Team Affinity. They did a Mother's Day conquest, uh, a random batter-up conquest. There was a smooth jazz conquest that was repeatable. Nation of Baseball has a ton of done, a ton of cards that you can get. A ton of hidden rewards as well. Right now, the only two that I have yet to do are the Texas Rangers City Connect jerseys and the Cincinnati Reds City Connect jerseys. I'm kind of like midway through both of those, so we'll do our best to uh, one of these we'll play a game in. You can press the Y button if you're on Xbox. If you're on PlayStation, it would be the triangle button. But there's these all these different rewards that you can get from completing the conquest. And some of them will sometimes be special rewards. Um, you know, take out a stronghold uh, within five turns of the conquest. As you can see, we are on turn four here. Uh, so it's only taken me four turns to get to this point. And I kind of wish that I had a fresh one to do. Um, I guess I could explain on this one if we really wanted to get... Um, into the weeds. You know what? I will. I will explain on this one. So let's go ahead and uh, let's see. Uh, can I do a re restart? So this is a very... Wait a minute. Is this how it starts? Okay, this is actually how it starts. I, I was under the impression that this had already... Yeah, I guess this is how this one starts. Alright, so this is a very simple uh, simplified version of Conquest, right? You're going to have your stronghold, uh, which is just your home base, and the objective is to take all of the enemy strongholds, which in this one, there's only one. So in order to do that, you have a set number of fans. If you look in the bottom left hand or bottom right hand corner, you will see the game details. We are on turn number one. We have 10 10 territories. 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 So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There we go. So we have 10 territories. And amongst those 10 territories, we have 31 million fans. So 13 plus 2 plus 1 plus 1 plus 4 plus 4 plus 1 plus 3 plus 1 plus 1. 31 million fans. And we can uh, then move fans in the attack phase so every time you start a new conquest you're going to immediately start in the, in the attack phase which is where you're going to take over the board 
essentially. So we have 13 fans here. Uh, let's start attacking some of these open territories. So we're just going to click on and we're just going to start moving our fans. We're going to start taking more territories. So, so now we have 15, now we have 16, now we have 17, now we have 18, now we have 19, 20, 21, and 22. And as you can see, they set this up so that you had the perfect amount of fans to take the bottom portion of the map. Now we have 22 territories. We still have 31 million fans. We still have the same amount of fans, but we the amount of territories that we own went up. We, we just took like 14 territories. I don't remember how many. And we also have no more places to go, so it automatically advanced us to the next stage, which is the steel fan stage. Now, nobody does this. Absolutely nobody does this. If you're doing this, this is a waste of time. The only way that you can steal fans is if you play a full three inning game and at that point you get like four fans, which is completely a waste of your time. Watch. I'll show you exactly how long it takes me to get four fans. You ready? You watching? Okay. Steal fans. We're going to skip this phase. We're going to go to the reinforced phase. And we just got seven reinforcements. So that's actually interesting. This actually breaks it down perfectly. You get one reinforcement for every three territories that you own, apparently. We have 22, and we just got seven reinforcements. So we will reinforce one of these three tiles so that we can continue moving and taking more pieces of the board. So we're going to reinforce there. That moves it to the next phase, which is the move fans phase. So right here, some of these... Uh, barricades or some of these borders that we, you know, um, cannot move from. We have four, we have four, we have two, we have three. One of these positions we can move. You get one move uh, per move fans phase or move phase. So we'll take these four fans and we'll go ahead and combine them up here to make it 11 fans up here and one fan down there. So now we are on turn two. We still have but now we have 38 million fans. So let's just do what we did before. And let's start taking more pieces, right? We're going to take more pieces. Now we have 28 territories, 29 territories, 30 territories, 31, 32. And now it automatically puts us in the reinforced phase. We're going to do it again. We're going to do the exact same thing again. We're back to the move phase fans back to combine forces, kind of strengthen our attack a little bit more. And let's just keep taking those territories, keep taking those territories, keep taking those territories until we've taken all the territories we can. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. So now we have seven fans left on this one dial. This is an owned dial. It's owned by the Padres. So we're going to attack this dial. And a lot of people, a lot of a big misconception is oh, you have to play this game. It's giving me the option to play the game. We're going to play the game. Do not do this. You're going to want to simulate the game. So it's six fans versus two fans. It's a medium simulated win chance. Nine times out of ten, you're going to win this. And we lost it. Wow. Okay, that, I mean, nine times out of ten, that was a little bit of a... Um, Those odds were, were not really true. Um, I'd say it's about a two-thirds chance that you win, honestly. But more times than not, you're going to win that battle. So what we just did is we just moved the reinforced phase. We just did the the uh, the moving phase. We strengthened our forces because we have 39 territories. So we should have just gotten, well, how many? Let's see. This will be 40 territories. That's an even number. So we took that spot. Now we have 14 is here versus 8 million fans so we could we could attack uh, we would play on veteran which is pretty fairly easy but if you want to play on rookie then you might want to just skip to the next phase we're in the steel fans phase we're going to skip that so we have 40 territories yeah so it's one one reinforcement for every three territories that you have we'll just add them there 
subscribe button for me. It really helps out the channel. And uh, you guys have been killing it lately with the support. It's been fantastic. So I really appreciate that. Also, let me know if you're coming on over from TikTok. If you if you uh, found my content through TikTok, I really want to hear where you guys found my content from. What your first video was that you maybe found me. Uh, I, I, I love hearing. There's, you know, the, the, a lot of times I'll be playing MLB and it's like, oh, I found you from. Uh, I used to watch your Siege videos, but I love this too. Or I used to watch your Fortnite videos, but I love this too. So it's fun. It's fun hearing all that. There we go. And, uh, yeah, this should be relatively easy. Um, again, veteran is pretty pretty easy for me. I usually play on like All Star. I'm used to playing online, a lot of BR, a lot of a lot of uh, ranked seasons as well. I got a pretty solid ranked record, so playing the computer is uh, a nice little change of pace. I don't know what that throw was. I don't know what that throw was. Probably could turn up the volume a little bit, but I'm, oh, that is a very softly hit ball. That's fine. That's fine. Ryan Mountcastle. Okay. There it is. Nice little connection there, please. The base runners sometimes get me so flustered, man. They get me so flustered. They will just straight up not go, and it's clearly, a, you know, just a base hit. I probably could have scored. I probably could have scored from second there. I'm probably gonna get the run out of here, but I don't care. Oh, barely snuck it in there. Barely snuck it in. All right, Evan Longoria, this was a BR reward. Um, I'm, he's very, very, oh my God, I just broke his ankle. His ankle is literally in pieces right now. Literally in pieces, I'm RIP in pieces. He's very underwhelming. His stats are solid, but uh, Oh my goodness, that one almost went into the bay. That one almost went in out over the uh, right field stands. PNC Park, man. Pirates have one of the... Pittsburgh is, is a beautiful city. Pittsburgh is literally probably one of the nicest cities I've been to. Um, just from like a... Like a I don't, I don't know about the, you know, I don't, I'm, I'm not going to get into all the politics of Pittsburgh. I don't know if it's a safe city or not, but as far as like a layout of everything goes, it is a beautiful city. Uh, PNC Park is a beautiful, beautiful park. I mean, look at the, I mean, what you see in the backdrop is, is essentially what you get. Um, actually, I'm pretty sure that building with the red right there, that might actually have been where uh, our hotel was. I think that's actually our hotel. When I um, went and watched a, a Pirates game, I think uh, either we stayed there. I can't remember exactly, but um, our friends stayed there. I can't remember. Oh, boy. That was a terrible pitch. I'm doing a very job, bad, very bad job of doing the pinpoint. Pinpoint is, is very finicky this year. Sometimes the pitches will go nowhere near where you put them, and it's just, it's just not good. It's just not good. Come on. There we go. Sullivan. Go get it, Sullivan. Okay. All right. Top of the second here. Come on. Come on. Hide inside fastball. 
kind of what these uh that's what these conquests are really good for it's just playing games you can play games against the computer while earning rewards right while earning either hidden rewards or jerseys or you know whatever it is while leveling up cards that maybe aren't the ones is that that's not a home run right oh my god it is <laughs> that was a terribly hit ball so we're getting xp for our cards that we wouldn't normally use in ranked um but we are required to get xp for them to complete certain programs like holy smokes that one was almost out of the park as well wow Is that that is also a home run? <laughs> yeah, veteran is uh, veterans really easy, guys. Like I was saying, Brett Sullivan hitting 429. Okay, different. Oh my goodness, that's three back to back home runs. That's three back to back bomb skis. Okay, all right. <laughs>
affects his stats. It affects his not only his control, but um, his hits per nine, his walks per nine. Everything gets hit. Everything gets affected. His home runs through nine. So suddenly, um, that means the opponent's PCI is going to be much bigger, and therefore they're going to. Yeah, that was. A, I just realized that that was. There goes the no hitter. Um, we can still get the complete game though. Oh jeez, computer's starting to take advantage of uh, our lack of energy here. It's fine. We can still complete. We can do a complete game, and I think you can get points, extra points for a shutout as well. So that's a sinker. That's not really a good placement for a sinker. We'll do a knuckle curve in the dirt here. I'll go get Mount Castle.